name's Kirk. I'm the owner and proprietor of West End Comics here at Queen Street West, 1590, deep in the heart of Parkdale. Let's go check out my shop. <laughs> of West End Comics. Uh, we're in year number seven now. Um, that's pretty much all there is to it. We've been a slow build. Every year we get a little bigger, a little better, uh, and a little more diverse. That's what I would say about our history. I don't think I ever really realized I wanted to open a comic book store until I did open a comic book store. That's the truth of it. Uh, yeah, I don't want to go into a too long a story about my background, but... Um, it was basically a situation where I was forced to change careers and this was a natural fit for me. Uh, so we went from uh, a family sort of eBay operation to a family store here in Parkdale, which is where I live and grew up. Stuff that flies off of our shelves comes in waves. So it depends on what's hot and what's not. Uh, right now, House of X, Hickman's new fantastic X-Men series gone by the time it hits the racks. Um, days gone by, Dungeons and Dragons, Art and Arcana, which we have a new copy of up there. Uh, all that we brought in lasted a few days. Who knew? Hi, my name's Chris. I'm the manager at West End Comics. I've been working here for about, actually three years as of this September. Yeah, we've had a few celebrities come through this store. Uh, Eric Andre came in for a day. Luckily, he didn't break anything. I think the most memorable, memorable for me was meeting uh, Jim Starlin. He came in with his entire family. He bought a Thanos figure. Truthfully, I didn't recognize him at first, but his uh, granddaughter was very sweet and said, oh, he made Thanos. It was awesome. The best thing about coming into a comic shop and buying your, co your comics here is that you get to interact with, in this case, myself and my partner, Chris. Um, it's the personal relationship that you develop with the, with the people that come into the shop. Uh, your ability to talk about various things, the, your ability to talk about the specific issue or item they're after. Um, it's that intimate relationship, I think, that you can't get online and uh, the dependability of uh, being able to talk to someone who knows what they're talking about. Uh, the best part of working at Western Comics for me is our community. We have a really fantastic group of people who come through on a regular basis, whether through our poll list or our board games night. We have D&D &D events. Um, and beyond just being our customers, a lot of them have become our friends. I moved down into Parkdale. I became roommates with one of our regular poll list customers. Like, it really changed my life working here, and it's been fantastic. Yeah, uh, good question. The one rare item that I'd like to have in the shop, if at all possible, Action Comics number one. I think I'm a Superman guy. That's the first appearance of Superman. It's the holy grail of comic books. Would I sell it? Ah, I don't know if I could get myself to do that. I'd have to keep it if I ever got a hold of it. Weird encounters with customers in the store. Well, I can say I've had a few for sure. Uh, we are located in Parkdale, which always makes day-to-day -day life interesting. A couple off the top of my head. I've had people come in and ask if we cut keys. Um, I've had a couple people try and ask me a question and I didn't really understand what they were saying. And then you get your day-to-day -day people aren't, who aren't very happy with what you think about their comic books or anything like that. So yeah, not too, too many. Most of our customers are great and we have a really good community, but we get some interesting characters for sure. Yeah, do we have events that happen in the store? Of course, we have uh, like every other comic book shop, free comic book day, we have book signings, comic book launches, uh, we've had art shows which were superhero related. Um, my mantra is never say no to an opportunity to have an event. Where can people find out more about West End Comics? Best thing to do, come on in and give us a visit. I'll let you know everything you wanna know. Other than that, uh, we have a website, westendcomics.ca. You can find us on Instagram at uh, WEC1590. That's WEC1590, our address. Uh, we're on Facebook. Um, we do as much social media as we can. Uh, all the links are on our website. Hey.